it's going down. Shalom. First and foremost, giving all praises, honor, glory, respect, and blessings to Yahweh, Bashem, Yahweh Shai, Bashem Rachakwadash. Salutations to the Lord's elect on the four quarters. Through the spirit and power of Yahweh Bashem Yahweh Shai. And welcome to another series of It's Going Down. Being brought to you by the spirit and power of Yahweh Bashem Yahweh Shai. French German leaders warn populations prepare for total cut off of Russian gas as social unrest looms so social unrest is looming as people start to suffer from um, gas problems and um, this has been an ongoing crisis really ever since NATO decided to put sanctions on Russia's gas supply you know and um <clears throat> you know ever since these sanctions what have been going on you know basically we've been seeing Europe struggling with gas issues for the past few months now even to the point to where they're only rationing gas out to essential services you know, or, or people who play a vital role in the country. As for regular civilians, they are greatly limiting the amount of gas they can put in their vehicle because there is currently a gas shortage going on in Europe. You know, but ultimately, at the end of the day, <clears throat> the United States is really to blame for this, right? Because they're the ones you know who got Europe to put those sanctions on, on Russia you know but then when you read books like Obadiah chapter 1 verse 7 you start to understand why NATO the beast that the uh, the dragon with seven heads and ten horns why they are going to turn on the United States of America okay because they're going to see, even NATO is going to see at one point that the United States here is the main problem. Well, the main problem of the earth, along with those uh, people dwelling in the land of Israel, them, them Khazars. But, um, okay, it says European populations are, are bracing for a frigid upon a oh, oh, frigid upcoming winter amid an impending avalanche of high energy costs and emerging inflation on Sunday French economy and finance minister Bruno Lee Marais warned that Russia is poised to totally halt gas supplies to Europe and that people must now prepare let's prepare for a total cutoff of Russian gas. Today is more likely is is the most likely option. Lee Marer told an audience at an economic conference in in what is it? Um Aixin province. Okay. It says he later additionally explained to reporters you know you you also have to prepare load shedding plans we are doing it it means looking in a very specific way at each company each employment area which are the companies 
that should reduce their energy consumption and which are the ones that cannot okay so then it goes on to say the French economic and finance minister Bruno filed image okay who cares it says he said the government is currently compiling a list of these major companies uh, which will be too at risk uh, if their facilities were suddenly deprived of gas supply they would receive priority in in the likely event of a shutoff from Russia we have to anticipate and put ourselves in order of battles as of now he emphasized as an example he offered according to the political okay Germany too is fearing the worst as its main conduit for Russian natural gas Nord Stream 1 has has long been scheduled to go down for 10-day maintenance starting Monday but the persisting fear is that Moscow won't bring it on bring it back online or the purpose of squeezing the German economy further as punishment for its Ukraine stance forcing Berlin into emerge emergency rationing okay but the emergency rationing of what gas Germany population of some 80 million is reliant on Russia for over one-third of total gas supplies and there's no immediate alternative should Moscow use a routine maintenance as a, as an excuse to keep supplies halted some German publications are even predicting social unrest as the as the squeeze gets put on the working class population in particular okay the prominent English language Dutch Willy surveys the alarming situation of many German German households already as rationing of hot water and electricity are taking effect as follows okay so as you can see these um gas issues is having a major impact on these different countries you know and it all started with those sanctions you know uh, that's pretty much all I'm gonna read there um, you know at the end of the day this is all judgment coming from the Heavenly Father and His Son Zephaniah 3 and 5 it says the just Lord is in the midst thereof he will not do iniquity every morning though if he bring his judgment to light he faileth not but the unjust knoweth no shame okay and who's the unjust well the unjust is talking about the wicked that's the two-thirds of our people as well as the so-called white man okay starting with the so-called elites trickling down to the rest of their nation of people that's the unjust okay so every morning Doth the Lord bring his judgment to light? And what are we seeing here? We're seeing the Lord's judgment being brought to light. Okay. The fact that these countries have to do all this, have to make preparations for in case of an event that Russia completely turn off their gas from these different countries well that's judgment from the Lord ultimately okay that's the Lord operating on the left hand side because the Lord said he would do these things okay hey if you want to rule the world in, in wickedness well guess what the Lord's got a little son for you man okay but um I don't want to make this video too long. With that, I'm going to say Shalom is on to the next one.